Welcome back to Spelling Minutes, everybody. This is week 20, and this is part one, our reading section. All right, let's check out what we're doing this week. This week, we're going to review words with long vowel sounds made with a silent E. Yes, the silent E has returned. Additionally, we're going to review words with the long E sound spelled EE. EE -E is E. The silent E changes our vowel to a long sound in the middle of the word. All right, let's see what we're doing. Feet. Use. Cone. Late. Jeep. Line. Gave. Round. Live and snake. All right. Did you see the extra word that's in there? It is round, and that is our OU digraph. Ow. All right, let's start. Oh, eight. Notice how I'm putting it all together because by now you should already know the silent E gives us that long vowel sound. Let's do it again. Oh. Eight, late, g, ave. One more time, g, ave, gave, k, own. Once again, k, own. Cone. Oh. Ein. One more time. Oh. Ein. Line. <sighs> Eat. There's that double E there. That's our double E digraph. And that sound is E. Once again. E T Feet J E P One more time J E P G P O I V Once again O I've live use there you can see this is only three letters you have that silent e there so that beginning u will automatically change to a long vowel sound once again use use Snake. There we have the SN. SN set together says sn. And then you have that silent E at the end giving us that long vowel A. Once again, sn. Ache. Snake. Er. Ow. Mmm. There's the OU in the middle. That's our OU digraph that says ow. Once again, er, ow, mmmd, round. All right, let's make some sentences. He was late. Once again, he was late. She gave me the card. One more time. She gave me the card. I want an ice cream cone. Once again. I want an ice cream cone. Make a line. One more time. Make a line. My feet are big. 
Once again, my feet are big. I have a Jeep. One more time. I have a Jeep. The race is live. One more time. The race is live. I use a pencil. Once again, I use a pencil. My snake is green. One more time. My snake is green. The ball is round. One more time. The ball is round. All right, everybody. Thank you for watching and practicing with me this week. Let's see what's coming up next week. What is going to be coming up next? We're going to spell plural forms of words. That is when we make a, something more than one. Okay? Please practice hard this week. See you next time. Bye.